it occurs to me that that was just game two. So, um, part two. Whoopsie. Um, I think I'm going to run back the same sideboarding. It's possible that I should switch things around a little bit. Now that I know my opponent has booting mandrels, like Palace Jailer becomes a much more reasonable inclusion. And now that I know my opponent is bringing in things like 10th Street Hooligan, my Chalice of the Voids are a little bit worse. So I could go like Jailer in and two Thalia Heretic Cathars in and play a little bit more threat dense. But doing this would make me softer to Dreadhorde Arcanist, which I slightly don't like. But I feel like most of the time if I'm casting my spells, I'm actually pretty good against that card. This is a little sketchy, but if my opponent doesn't play a creature turn one, I just wasteland them. It did play a creature turn one. That's okay. <clears throat> it flipping is less good because that eliminates my out of uh, Plague Engineer. Um, it is now appearing <clears throat> that we are just going to be in classic get delvered territory pretty quickly here. getting punished for playing Eldrazi Temple over Ancient Tomb. Um, so I'm going to jam into Daze here, but I don't think I can beat a Daze. Yep. <coughs> so Looking at Plague Engineering Wizard to stop this from flashing back spells. Oh, nope, okay, I'm just gonna be dead. I'm gonna be dead right now. Well, we'll we'll upload these like three minutes of video, I guess. My bad. <laughs> 